print to improve by the pressure on the fabric. We go the light colour first down, which is the new magenta tint of 6% power. Just straight towards myself. Slow so it feeds ink into the fabric. And as a safety rule with any print, you go the one direction, you can mitigate a lot of stretch in your mesh. So you still maintain a really sharp quality image, even if your screen's getting a bit old. With the heat gun, if you get these really quite hot print um, heat guns, they're used by the um, panel beating people, spray painting people. They're really, really quite hot. You can dry your print really quite quickly. And when you've got a pile of 50, 100, 200 to do, it saves you a lot of time. So once again, two prints towards myself. 45 degree angle on your squeegee. And the weight is the weight of a firm handshake. As opposed to over, over being heavy or being over light. If you think of it as a firm handshake, it's a pretty good rule of thumb. And it's like, this result, every time, just make sure the light's not going through that. But really that's, we printed this probably three times now, this is the superior version, although we're still on the same screens, just simply because of the tints. The grey especially is perfect to me. The grey is, I think, 3% tint, of the original black, and the magenta is a 6% tint of the original magenta, as you'd buy it straight from Permacet. So it sort of gives you an idea of just how much you can push these colors down in pigment value. Technically by that, I think if you buy a one liter, you could make you know, quite a few liters of this tint power from a one liter piece. 